Now let's try this problem. If a1 is equal to 1 and a n plus 1 is equal to twice a n plus 5 for n is equal to 1, 2 and so on, then a100 is equal to. Okay, friends, uh, we just uh, find out the first 3, 4 uh, numbers uh, of, or uh, maybe numbers in this particular sequence, then we will be able to generalize it. Okay, now first of all, a1 is equal to 1. Now a2 will be 2 a1 plus 5. Okay, suppose I put n is equal to 1, then it will be a2. So, it will be 2 a1 plus 5. So, a1 is 1. So, it's 2 plus 5, 7. Similarly, a3 is 2 a2 plus 5. So, 2 a2, that is 2 into 7, that is 14 plus 5, 19. Okay, similarly, we can find out a4. Though it is not required, we can even find out the sequence from this, these data only. But then also for the better clarity of concept, and uh, to get assured of the answer, we just find out. Now, A4 is what? 2 times A3, that is 38 plus 5, that is 43. Okay. Now, after this, uh, we will go by option. Okay. Now, let's do it uh, from option A. Suppose this is the value of A100. Okay. If A100 is there, then there is 2 raised to 99. Okay, so in that case, try to we try to find out the value of A2. So A2 will be, if for 100 it is 99 over here, that means for A2 it will be 1 over here. So it is 5 into 2 raised to 1 minus 6. So it's 10 minus 6, 4. But we are having the value of A2 as 7. So this is the incorrect choice. Similarly, over here, it's 5 into 2 raised to 1 plus 6. That is 10 plus 6, 16. But we are having 7 over here. So, even this is incorrect choice. Okay. Now, for the third, it is 6 into 2 raised to 1 plus 5. That is 12 plus 5, 17. But we are having 7 over here. So, even it is incorrect choice. Now, let's take the fourth example. Uh, fourth uh, option, it's 6 into 2 minus 5. That is 6, 2 is 12 minus 5, 7. So, it can be the correct choice. Uh, though all three we have rejected. So, we can be sure of that this is a correct choice. But for Assurance, let's try for A3 also. So, it's 6 into 2 raised to 2 minus 5. That is 2 twos are 4 into 6, 24 minus 5, 19. And we are having the value of A3 as 19. So, definitely this is the correct choice. Okay, do not try to find out any formula for the expression. It will take a lot of time of yours. And you know that time is the biggest restriction in uh, any competitive exam. I hope you are clear with the method.